Five years ago, I did my very first cheat day and used to do cheat days about once a month to appease my really big appetite. I did want to talk about how I'm utilizing this to potentially help my crazy appetite. Three years ago, I decided to go all in and gave myself unconditional permission to eat whatever I wanted to finally fix my hunger. I'm not nearly as hungry anymore. So here we are, three years later, to see how my appetite has changed. Hit me! Ten! I ten to this! That's intense. Yeah? That looks juicy. Am I a complete mess? A little bit. <laughs> that one's so good. <laughs> I have a vague memory of what I ate for my first meal. I know it's a big one, but I don't remember exactly. So we're gonna write it down. It's gonna be the biggest order Tim is gonna have this morning for <laughs> one person. Okay. Good morning. Oh, good morning. Who is my this? today. I am doing a cheat day. So I'm just going to do and eat whatever I feel like today. A number seven. I'm gonna do 12 donuts and then 10 timbits. What did I say? It's a number seven. I don't know. Oh. We're gonna <laughs> so I'm curious on a scale of one to ten, how hungry are you right now? A ten hungry. Ten hungry. I don't have to remember Bruh. that. It tastes really good because I'm really hungry. You look like a ten. Cut the cheese. Hash brown, got it. Okay, vanilla dip. <laughs> That's good. Man, I thought everything was good. Wow, this is a Coconut cream. great glass of water. I know. <laughs> oh, the cinnamon roll. Lay cinnamon roll. Man, this video's lit. <laughs> 2,700 calories. Four or five out of ten full. I better get started. Yeah, I'm on a smoothie. Let's get it. Are you excited? You look like a 10. You look like an 11 now. <laughs> so bad. Just close up. Okay. Hey. <laughs> Let's do this. They're not exact. Obviously, they couldn't be the exact same ones, but I feel like the ones that we got that are not that were not available, they look better. They do, actually. S'mores and strawberry. Just to like make a comment, my appetite is so much lower, but it doesn't mean that I still don't love food. I still love food the same way that I did before. Like, who doesn't love a donut regardless of where their appetite is? Like, I still love donuts, so don't get it twisted. Mm. Did you see this? Tim's ex, Justin Bieber. The Biebs, man. He hey, has his, yeah, Tim, Tim Biebs. Biebs. Yeah. I haven't been in Canada in a while. <laughs> we did get Tim Bits in the first video. I eat the savory first. Mmm. Good hash brown. Oh wait, how how hungry are you on a scale of mm. one to ten before you start? Ten, ten is like completely full. Like ten is stuff. Oh. Zero is is like I'm starving. Good thinking. Yeah. Put a scale. Yeah. I would say I'm like a five. Okay. I don't feel super hungry in the morning like I used to. Egg and cheese, classic. Let's go. Oh my. Yeah. I feel like old Stephanie would have been like, leave me some. Yeah. <laughs> Have some bites of each. Yeah. Vanilla dip. Let's see it, bruh. What you got oh, there? Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> wow. Washed. Nah, we still got it, bro. Come we on. Still got it. What one? What one looks best to you right now? Like what strawberry. One? Yeah, did, go for it. Yeah. Mm. What are you rating that one? How good is it? Compared to like a Krispy Kreme or a Dunkin' Donuts strawberry. It's not as good. Mm. I don't know, like a five out of ten. What? Dunkin' makes the best strawberry. Mm. Krispy Kreme has the best donuts in mm -hmm. general, but Dunkin' makes, in my opinion, the best strawberry. Let's do half the cream. That, that's Tim's best donut, in my opinion. Yeah, I think so too. I agree. Should I just do it after I take a bite? No, nah, dude. <laughs> Can you I just forgot. get the manual back out? Or... <laughs> oh, yeah. Ooh, that looks juicy. Give me a bite of that one, look. It's the best one. 
from ours. Yeah, definitely. It looks that good. one looks amazing. Mm -hmm. yeah, That one is so good. Mmm, that's money. I would rate that a solid eight, eight and a half, maybe. Maple, right? Maybe maple. When I say the word Canadian, it's just implied that I mean maple. <laughs> They're like synonymous with each other. <laughs> you love maple stuff. Mm -hmm. Wow, it looks really good. They look really good on camera. You all right? Do the honey cruller. I want to see it. If you're taking fan requests. It's so unique. It's like airy. Give us a taste of that look. <laughs> that one's good. Oh, this is the sour cream. Mmm. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I want this one. This one. Mm. Birthday cake. Mmm. Mm. That's so good. That is really good. Super birthday cakey. I can see why you like that. I want to have a bite of the apple fritter before I pause on the donuts. Mm. Mm. I feel like this is better than five years ago. Oh yeah? Five years. <laughs> there are actual bits of apple in it. That's apple. Oh. Stewed chocolate. To all the haters of cake donuts, I love cake donuts. <laughs> Okay. I might have to call it there. Mm. How full on a scale of 1 to 10? I feel like an 8. Mm. My intuitive eating brain stops here. I feel like that would be like what I should do for the rest of this video. But it was still fun. It was still delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. biggest things that I noticed while I was eating is I don't want so much sweet stuff all in one sitting. I was kind of feeling like I wish I had more savory stuff. It felt like when I was doing a cheat day before, I there was not enough sweet food in the world for me to eat. But now I don't feel that way. I need like more of a balance. Anyways, we'll see how it goes. I'll see you the next meal. Alright guys, so we are at Boston Pizza. Oh so my god. Like appetizer. <laughs> okay, appetizer, Thai chicken bites. Okay, meal to 3,000 calories. Oh, so that was the biggest meal of them all. Dang. Okay, okay. Yum. You ready? Let's do it. Oh, the camera looks like it's pointing over there. It's like yeah. I have an invisible phone. <laughs> I'm feeling kind of hungry. So, I don't feel like I ate a ton of food. No. So, I'm feeling pretty hungry. It's um 224. Whoa. Ready for this? Let's go. I'm ready. Cheers. Mm, yeah, yeah. I gave these an eight and a half out of ten. I agree with my original mm. rating. These are really good. Yeah. What, what I've noticed is your your savory ratings seem to be about the same. You know, like you enjoy savory stuff about equally, but it seems like you enjoy sweet stuff a little bit less. I think that it was before all in savory sweet. Mm. After all in, it just kind of, mm -hmm. it's still mm -hmm. higher, but it's just gotten more even. It's, it's way more balanced now. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so my pizza's came, and I got a Mediterranean pizza here, covered in pesto sauce. This is the um, barbecue chicken pizza. And this is a tropical chicken pizza. It has pineapple and chicken on it. <laughs> it looks really good. First thing I'm gonna try is the Mediterranean. So. Barbecue chicken. Ah, it's good. Yeah. What one do you like better, Mediterranean or barbecue? I would say it's a tie. Mm. They're both good. <laughs> Tropical chicken. That was really good. Am I a complete mess? A little bit. <laughs> Got that. I can see that. It looks yeah. really fresh. Honestly, I can't tell you which one I like the best. They're all so good. I would give all of them like a 9 out of 10. Whoa. They're all really good. Delicious. <laughs> Jeff 
Jeff is having a Mediterranean slice. <laughs> These are bigger too. Mm -hmm. I feel like 2017 Stephanie would be proud. Proud of what? The fact that you like aren't hungry and like you can eat like a normal sized portion. You know what I mean? Not just proud, she would be like crying. Yeah, yeah. She'd be weeping with joy. I mean, at that point, I didn't know it was possible to fix it. Exactly. I thought I just would have to live with it. I did not realize this game was. <laughs> <laughs> so I ended up doing mediums, thinking that's what I got in the first video. I actually got smalls. I actually, you know, like ate bigger slices this time. Two tropical chicken slices. I had two Mediterranean, and then I had one of the barbecue chicken. So I ate five slices, which is pretty good. And the appetizer, real good, and I'm ready for dessert. Yeah, so the dessert that I got five years ago, they don't have it anymore, the pinocchi thing. We're deciding on something else, but I'm sure it'll still be delicious. The yeah. chocolate explosion looks like it'd be better though. Mm -hmm. So let's go with that. No pizza will be wasted in the making of this video. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. Oh, they drew a flower. Look at that. It's art. Chocolate mousse. I don't know what that is, but it looks good. And then this looks like it's brownie. So I'm gonna get a little bit of everything. Nah, oh, bro, that looks delicious to me. Wow. Ah. Really rich. Wow. <laughs> I feel like I need to drink some water. <laughs> That's intense. Yeah. Mmm. Rich. Mmm. Great though. Incredibly good. I love that. That's good. I recommend that. On a scale of 1 to 10, how full are you? So it was like an 8 out of 10 after the pizza. And the dessert, like, just like a tiny bit, like a quarter of a notch. It was like a little cherry on top. Before, I would start to feel physical fullness before I felt mental fullness. Now, I feel mental fullness before I feel physical fullness. I mentally don't want anything more, but physically can eat. I could, like my stomach could contain more food, but I just don't want it to. Yeah, that makes sense. Makes sense? Yeah. I forgot about that. As you can see, I have a lot of goodies in front of me. I think it was like I was trying to satisfy every single craving. I just feel very satisfied. That's good. So that's it. That's all she wrote. Okay. 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 Nothing looks similar to me. This is like what my grandma would make. No, I want you to, maybe you would like it. Should I get it? Why not? Do you want it? Yeah, just get it. <laughs> okay guys, so this is my next meal. It's a lot of delicious looking food, but I'm just not in the mood for it right now. Like after eating the pizza, like I, I will eat it. I'm gonna eat a sandwich first because I feel like I need something not only savory, but that isn't junk. I don't know, I have no cravings for that. Real quick, I'm gonna have a sandwich. It's just a plain avocado and turkey sandwich. I'm just gonna eat this really quick, then I'm gonna move on to that stuff. What looks better to you right now? That or that? This is so good to me right now. <laughs> you should start with the dates. Okay. Because they, they're off. We're off video right now. Free balling. Yeah. But no, that's not improvising. Okay. Free balling. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> they look Gives amazing. Me a yes, that's what Am I in the shot? I feel like it's shooting at my imaginary friend again. That's nice. Uh huh. I, I knew you'd like that. I knew it. Mm. Tastes like a, a granola oatmeal bar. Mmm. They're good. It's got like a spice to it. That's why I thought you would like mm -hmm. it. You know how I like mm -hmm. carrot cake. Mm -hmm. This is delicious. Hit me. Get the chips. These are super good. So let's just start with one serving. Okay. Does anyone else know how to do this with their chip bag? Like that. Like, does anyone else do this? And then it like. You know, like there's, you don't That's need a clip. Genius. I've always done that my whole life, and like whenever I do that in front of people, they're like. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to mention that 
something that I think is gonna, that's gonna be really different from my cheat days to today is that I don't foresee feeling really bloated tomorrow or and still having like a food baby because I just like, you know, on cheat days I did, I ate a lot of food and I was still digesting food the next day. Whereas tomorrow I don't foresee like feeling all that different because my body is just more used to diverse foods. Whereas before my food and my dietary preferences were a lot more bland. Having cheat days with lots of sodium and lots of carbs would impact my body differently than I think it would now. I think tomorrow I'll pretty much feel the same. <laughs> you getting full? <laughs> I'm not getting full, I'm just tired. You're of just them. tired of ketchup chips? Yeah. I'll log it as like half a serving. Yeah. Hit me. Ready for number two? Yeah. So this wasn't in the first cheat day, but it is coconut based. And they're really I love good. coconut. We couldn't find a bounty bar. They're close enough and they look yummy. Mm -hmm. That sounds right. I don't even know how you open them. There we go. Dang it. You lost the whole inside. I lost it. <laughs> it's good. I'm gonna have another one. Mmm, really coconutty. Mm -hmm. There's a nut in the middle. These are childproof. They make you earn it, bro. Mmm, yummy. There's like a cream filling with a nut. That's super good. Coming at you next. <laughs> Yum. Man, I just destroyed that. Did I get the wrong ones? They look different. Wait. The ones I had were like round discs. They're good though. Sour candy is super good. They're yummy. Yeah. They're they're quite sour. More like sour patch kids, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You want some? Okay, let's do the mint carol bar. Mint chocolate, and it's nice and green on the inside, and it's like bubbly. It's actually quite good. I wasn't fair to it the first time. It's actually kind of good. Let's see how O. Henry treats you. I, I've had this many, many times. I love this part. I couldn't have messed that up anymore. <laughs> it looks real. It looks it looked real. It's like, oh, because I'm so used to Snickers, that I feel like it's a better version of a Snickers. Hit me. Get your peanut butter fix. Good old Reese's. Reliable, steady, kind of like Jeff. I can't open this either. <laughs> this whole video is me opening stuff. Did you need to see the inside of a Reese's? Yeah, I just, just messed that up you again. You can just pop it in here. <laughs> it's right here. Apple pie. So I couldn't find the apple blackberry crisp thing that I made in my last video. This is as good as it's gonna get. How many calories in a in a fifth? 290. 104. Good enough. Looks good. It smells delicious. Oh. <laughs> it's still hot, but it's good. It's good apple pie. You love apple pie, though. I do. What was your favorite thing that you ate today? Of the savory food, the pizza. And then of the sweet, I think that's s'mores donuts. That was really good. Yeah. But if you're still hungry, then have something. That's the name of the game, right? Spice up this video a bit. Cold pizza. Yeah, like it doesn't feel appealing to me. I don't know what I'm in the mood for. Like I want like sushi or something. Mm. Try not to go off script too much. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you need like a meal. Like that sandwich was small. So I'm just gonna have a couple bites of this and then yeah. call it. Is it me or my imaginary friend in the shop? <laughs> uh, we got room for both of you. Yeah, we got room for both. <laughs> I didn't really make that big of a dent on these tidbits. The sour cream one. Now I'm feeling kind of like too much. That was fun. That was a good day. Feeling full, satisfied. I remember doing this speech after every cheat day and it feels weird making that speech again. But here we are, <laughs> three years, post all in, full, satisfied, happy, ready for bed. It was a fun day, I had a really good time. The food was delicious, like, but I don't think I can eat the way I used to. And I'm very, very, very happy for that. I'm not the old Stephanie anymore, but I hope that you guys still love me. I hope that you guys 
don't mind that I can't eat 10,000 calories in a day anymore because if that's the only reason you liked me, then maybe I need to reevaluate my life. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you to my imaginary friend for joining me and collabing with me on this video. I love you so much and I will see you 